Hello, in this video I'm gonna show you how to turn on or off and restart a laptop. Here I have a laptop and now it's shut down, so first we can turn it on. To turn it on, first you need to open the lid. The lid mm, is opened the way that the logo should be facing you upside down. So, um, I know it's not the most logical, but it works like that. And now, when the lid is opened, you should find the power key. The power key may be embedded to the keyboard, or maybe somewhere on the chassis, so it may be here, or there, anywhere. It, it may have the sign on it or not, it really depends on the laptop. And on some laptops, I've found the key to be on the side, on the right or the left side. Sometimes even on the front side. So you should locate your power key. If you cannot locate it, go into your manual and you should find the info about the power key here. Then just quickly press on the power button. And you can see that the laptop is powering on in my case. And after a short while, it is on. You can now unlock it and use. Now let's move on to restarting a laptop. Also, if your laptop didn't turn on, that may be due to it being discharged. So if it doesn't turn on, first make sure that you have a charger plugged in because the um, battery might have, might have died. So plug in a charger, that's uh, the correct one, and plug it into the correct port. Sometimes it will look like mine, sometimes it will be wider, rectangular, or it will be USB-C port. It really depends on a laptop. I'm gonna plug it in, and now you should be able to power on your laptop. If this also didn't work, you should try pressing and holding on the power key. And if this also didn't work, then that may be due to some, um, some malfunctions and you should service your laptop. Now let's move on to restarting. To restart your laptop, you should find the start button. It may be somewhere here, also it may be here. Sometimes it looks like it's from a perspective and sometimes it's flat. It depends on your system. And if you don't have Windows and you have Linux, then it may be much different. So if you have Linux, you should know your system and where to find it. Mm, because there are multiple distributions. But on Windows, uh, which is the most used system, it should look something like this. Just click on that. And now you should find the uh, button that, that looks like this. It may be either here or somewhere here. So it also depends on the version of Windows. Click on that. And now click on restart. Now your laptop will restart. If this didn't work, if your laptop freezes or you cannot access that restart menu, then you should force restart it, which I'm gonna show you after the laptop powers on. Now the laptop is on, so I can unlock it. And now let's see the force restart. To force restart it, you should press and hold on the power key until the display goes off and the fans stop spinning. So let's press and hold on this button. After the screen goes off, you can release the button and now it's forced shut down. To turn it on, just click on the button like you would normally turn on your laptop. And this is the force restart method. So now we're gonna move on to the shutdown, 
which I've already shown you the force shutdown. So if the method that I'm gonna show you right now doesn't work, then you should force shut down it by pressing and holding on the power key. But the first thing you should try is to go into the start button like we would for a restart. So, so let's wait until it logs in. And now let's do the same as we did to restart, but instead let's choose the shutdown. So the start button, then the power icon, and now click on shutdown. And this is the first method you should try when shutting down, and if it fails, then press and hold on the button to force shut down it. And that's basically it. That's all for today. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you next time.